Good morning, Thank friends. Miss Molly, Miss Cindy, Miss Ashley, Mr. Josh, we're back. And this week, yeah. we're talking about farms. And before we talk about farms, we gotta sing our good morning song. Let's get started. Good morning, good morning. It's a good, 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 good morning. We say hello and how do you do? To all our friends and teachers too. Good morning, good morning. It's a good, 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 good morning. All right. All nice right. Job. I think we're gonna sing a classic farm song. Can Ooh. you guys guess what it is? It's mm. Old McDonald had oh. a farm. Oh. Right. We're gonna do it a little bit today. different today. I'm going to pick an animal. As we're singing, I'm going to pick an animal out of the box, and that will be the sound that we make. Are you guys ready? All right. Oh, I sh do you guys want to know which one I'm gonna pick? No, we can see. No, you can, can see. Fly. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Old McDonald had a farm. E I E I O. A moo moo here and a moo moo there. Here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm. E I E I O. And on that farm he had a pig. E I E I O. With an oink oink here and an oink oink there. Here, here oink, there oink. oink everywhere a oink, oink. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Make sure you're and singing, friends. Yep, yeah. we want to hear you. There's a lot of voices. And on that farm, he had a horse. E-I-E-I-O. E -I -E -I -O. With, With a nay, nay here, here, and a nay, nay here. Here, a nay, 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 nay. Everywhere, <laughs> nay, nay, old McDonald had a farm. E I E I O. All right, great singing, friends. Yes. I guess we have another song. What other song yes. do you want to sing? Next, we are going to sing Bingo because it's about a farmer that has a dog. Oh. All right, you guys ready? All right, here we go. There was a farmer had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, B I N G O. B I N G O B I N G O and Bingo was his name O. There was a farmer who had a dog and Bingo was his name O. I N G O I N G O I N G O and Bingo was his name O. There was a farmer who had a dog and Bingo was his name O. N G O N G O NGO and Bingo was his name O. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name O. Geo, Geo, Geo and Bingo was his name O. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name O. O, O, O and Bingo was his name O. There was a farmer who had a dog and Bingo was his name up. And Bingo was his name up. Nice job. Nice hey. job. All right. Good. I clapped Woo. too hard, my hands hurt. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, guys, since we are going to be talking about farm animals and farms this week, I have a story for you guys called Big Red Barn. By the big red barn in the great green field, there was a pink pig learning to squeal. There was a great big horse and a very little horse. And on every barn is a weather vane, of course, a golden flying horse. That tells you guys what direction the wind is blowing, it moves around. There was a big pile of hay and a little pile of hay, and that is where the children play. But in this story, the children are away. Only the animals are here today. You guys see the farm animals in this picture. We have a horse, 
a baby horse, a goose, and a pig. The sheep and the donkey, the geese and the goats were making funny noises down in their throats. And an old scarecrow was leaning on his hoe and a field mouse was born. In a field of corn. Did you guys know that corn and other fruits and vegetables can be grown on farms too? Cock-a-doodle-doo, in the barn there was a rooster and a pigeon too. And a big white hen standing on one leg and under the hen do you guys see what it is? There was one egg. Our hens lay eggs at school. There was a bantam rooster and a little bantam hen with a big clutch of eggs. You guys have to help me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are ten. There was a big red dog with some little puppy dogs all round and warm and they all lived together in the big red barn and they played all day in the grass and the hay. When the sun went down in the great green field, the big cow lowed and the little pig squealed, the horses stomped in the sweet warm hay and the little donkey gave one last bray. This is where we need a donkey, you guys. Come running through in the middle. <laughs> The hens were sleeping on their nests. Even the roosters took a rest. The little black bats flew away out of the barn at the end of the day. And there they were all night long, sound asleep in the big red barn. All right guys, now Miss Molly has a fun little guessing game for us. So we are going to guess some farm animals. All right friends, I have a couple little riddles for us to do. We're gonna, I'm gonna read you what's on the paper, and then we're gonna guess, or you're gonna guess, what animal this riddle is talking about. Up here it says, who am I? Are you ready? Let's see if I can get it so there's no glare, there we go. I have two legs, a tail and wings, but as hard as I try, I still cannot fly. I eat worms, grains, and bugs. Sadly, I'm not an animal that gets many hugs. Aww. I work very hard laying eggs in my coop, and most people like to put me in soup. What do you think? What do you think? It's a hen or a chicken. Oh, look at that. We got one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's another one. Oh, that was a great reaction. <laughs> the math makes you so happy. They do. <laughs> All right, here's another one. We're going to guess another one. I am fluffy and warm in my furry coat. Although we look smaller, I am not a goat. That says similar, not smaller, sorry. I live in a herd which is a large mass and during the day I eat lots of grass. Farmers trim me, they turn me and pull. They don't stop until they get all of my wool. What do you think? What do we have? It's a sheep, you got it. Oh, look at Mr. Joshy. Good guessing. Can't tell where the camera is on this. All right, last one. Here we go. Who am I? I am white with spots that are brown or black. I like to eat hay and grass for a snack. I eat when I can and I chew and chew. And when I don't eat, I say moo, moo. To know who I am, consider this link. I'm very famous for, for giving you milk. That doesn't rhyme. <laughs> I, I'm a cow. Look at that. Let's see if we can find a cow back there somewhere. Oh, look it. Good job, friends. Miss Ashley's going to read you a story now. But hey, that was really, I cannot even look at it. That was really good. Nice job, friends. Thanks for the back. <clears throat> Hi, friends. I'm not looking at the camera. I have another story for you. It's kind of more about plants and food that we eat that comes from the farm. This is called Anywhere Farm. For an Anywhere Farm, here's all that you need. Soil, sunshine, some water and a, can you tell what that is? 
a seed. Fat seed or skinny seed, pointy or round, tenderly tuck it down into the ground. Then you watch and you wait, you water, you weed, your seed will sprout out at its own seedy speed. See the sprout there? And you'll have an anywhere, anywhere farm. Where can you plant your anywhere farm? An old empty lot makes a good growing spot. But a pan or a bucket, a pot or a shoe, a bin or a tin or a window will do. Plant a farm in a crate, plant a farm in a cup, in a box on a balcony 10 stories up. Look at all these creative places they're planting the plants. Plant a farm in a truck, in a box on a bike. Plant an anywhere farm, anywhere that you like. Sounded a little like Dr. Seuss. Anywhere that you have some soil, some seed, some sunshine and water, that's all you need for your anywhere, anywhere, anywhere farm. What can you plant on your anywhere farm? Kale in a pail? Corn in a horn? That's kind of silly, look. They planted it right in that horn. I have some corn. Corn grows on the farm. Beets and zucchini, oregano, beans, jicama, broccoli, radishes, greens, tomatoes, potatoes, peppers, and peas. On your anywhere farm, plant what you please. So all these vegetables that you have at your home and you eat with your lunch or your dinner, grows on a farm. Who might come to visit your anywhere farm? You might see a monarch. What's a monarch? It's a type of butterfly. A ladybug, bees, hummingbirds, cardinals, or fat chickadees. Those last two are birds. Look, at this is the neighborhood garden and the farmer's market. Your neighbors might come. When they see what you've grown, they might want an anywhere farm of their own. You might give them some seeds that they plant in a can, a carton, a wash tub, an old frying pan, in a boat or a boot or right in their yard. Anyone can do it. You've showed it's not hard. With your farm in a basket and mine on a chair, with soil and sunshine and water and care, one day, all our Anywhere Farms, Anywhere might turn into an Everywhere Farm. Everywhere. Look at all those plants. I see some tomatoes, some sunflowers, all kinds of plants in their Anywhere garden. Where does it all start? What do you need? Just one farmer, you, and one little seed. See the sprout with the two leaves and it has the roots that go under the water, under the soil? That's how farmers plant our food. The end. All right. I did not do the food thing. Also, there was a spider that kept moving very close to me. <laughs> Spooky. FYI. Hi. I've got a bag that you guys are gonna be able to take home Let's look inside and see what we got. First thing we have, wow. It's all one thing. Look at that. Color and plant activity. Color the farm, plant the beans and seeds in the soil with the glue. So we've got a little picture. What's that? You guys tell me. And then, look at all these things we have in here. Look at all these seeds. That's pretty cool. That's something that you're gonna be able to do. We also have all these, uh, I'm gonna say pom-poms. Cotton balls. Cotton balls, thank you. I keep saying pom-poms. Cotton balls and a sheep. Bah. Bah. That's right, and you guys can boop, put all his wool on. He's naked. And lastly, we have if I can pick up the paper, it's real sticky. Right now. Right. Oh, wow.
There's actually two more things. We have this. There we go. Kind of looks like uh, some barns. And what are these? Little stickers. And you can decorate your barn with them. And now, lastly, and finally, we have a matching game. So we got like tractors and different animals in there that you guys are gonna be able to match. And that's what's in our bag this week. Uh -oh. Hey, we're gonna say goodbye now. So I'll meet you over there. So busy that I forgot to say goodbye to you guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bye, friends. I hope you guys enjoy our Farm Week video and our Farm Week bags. We think they're pretty fun. My farm animal friends need to go eat their farm animal breakfast now, though, so we have to say goodbye Bye. to you. And we'll see you guys soon. Move. Bye. 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 I'm going to go eat my corn. Oh. Really? You guys thought this thing was over, huh? Surprise, surprise. Wow. Hey, what's up, lunch teachers? Don't mind me, we're gonna go look at the chickens, bye! Chickens! Wow. here with the chickens guys I'm gonna check to see if they have eggs they have water it looks kind of gross though so I'm gonna sometimes we dump it out let new water get in there there we go now I'm gonna you guys see Scoop. Down for them. There you go. Yum, yum, yum. I need this lid on here. If the lid isn't on there, uh, we've found mice and rats in there before. We don't want that. All right. Any eggs? I don't see any. No, nope, that's just poop. It doesn't work. Sorry, chicken. Sorry, sorry, chicken. Got it. Close one. I'm just gonna hang him back up. And we did it. And this has been our lunchy circle time video. Thanks for watching.